Hey guys, Marlon here from Games of Warriors channel. Now I have a quick news video for you guys and girls today. And today I had to put on my nerd glasses for this one. So apparently Digital Foundry is being sued uh, by a company called 34 Big Things. And they're the makers of Red Out Lightspeed Edition. They're pointing out that the Xbox X version of their rend rendered at 1080p, which is including a significant amount of out outrage um, against 34 big things as you can see the images below particularly because of the ps4 pro version is currently rendered out at a more stable frame rate compared to the xbox x so they're suing uh digital foundry for some of the frame rate issues there i don't know how this is going to work out but this is quite crazy because why would you blame digital foundry it should be them the developer that actually made the game when it comes down to the frame rate so it's it's stuff is all over the place link will be in the description here and digital foundry you know they do a pretty good job of analyzing frame rates and how games run and things like that nature so we're just gonna have to wait and see how this legal action suit uh affects digital foundry now let's move on to the second part of the news video here spider-man design director played through the game uh, multiple times and he's saying that each uh, playthrough uh, took him multiple days so that's really really good guys that that just goes to show you that spider-man is going to take a long time to play through each of the the levels or whatever so spider-man meets Grand Theft Auto or meets fallout who knows man that that's really good though because I'm really hyped for this spider-man hopefully it comes out this year all right guys the last bit of news that we have for y'all today is Nintendo reveals the most played games on switch since launch in North America so the first game of course is Zelda breath of the wild second Mario Odyssey third uh, we have Mario Kart 8 deluxe Splatoon 2 uh, Minecraft Nintendo Switch Edition, Stardew Valley, uh, Mario Plus Rabbit's Battle, Arms, The Elder Scrolls uh, 5 Skyrim, The Binding of Isaac, Afterbirth, uh, NBA 2K18, uh, Dragon Ball Xenoverse 2, Fire Emblem Warriors, Lego City Undercover, uh, Sonic Mania, Pokémon Tournament DX, 1 and 2 Switch, uh, FIFA 18, uh, Disneynia 5 Complete Edition there, and Rocket League. So there's no surprise there that Breath of the Wild is at number one. It won Game of the Year over uh, Super Mario Odyssey. So guys, if you enjoyed today's news video, please smash a staggering 50 likes, guys, as this is a New Year thing for us on Games and Warriors channel. Thank you all so much for the tremendous support. We're trying to hit 18,000 by the end of this month, and I know we can do it. Love you all so much. Peace, G Nation. I'm out of here. Happy Sunday.